The first safe we can find in the game is found in the safe house. We can find it during any section of the safe house throughout the campaign, however this is the most involved safe in the game having multiple puzzles connected to it. To start we're going to head down into the basement for the boiler puzzle. You can just follow along with what I do on screen, but we need to restart the boiler first by turning the boiler valve twice to turn it off, then turning the fuel valve once, then we'll interact with the pilot to start it, and finally turn the boiler valve twice again to turn it back on. We'll know that we've done it right when the light on the boiler shows green and we can head into the piano room for the next step. In the piano room we can pick up the black light which we will use for some more steps later on but for now if we look around the room with the light we can find hidden numbers and letters. These correspond to the keys on the piano in the order we have to play them in. This seems to be the same code every time so you can just follow along with what I do on screen to open the secret door and head downstairs. There's a couple things for us to do down here, so first we're going to head down the hall and turn right to find a door locked by a keypad. We need to use the black light to see the fingerprints on the buttons, then guess the correct order of the numbers. Similar to games like Wordle, the keypad will let us know if we have a number out of place, if it's in the correct spot, or if we chose a wrong number entirely. I believe this code is random, so don't just copy mine here. Through the door we can find a computer for another puzzle. This time we need to create words based on the cipher at the bottom of the screen. The four words we have to make will always be the same, however I believe their order might be different. The words are bunker, room, holding, and open. After that computer we can head back out to the hallway and turn right, then head through the door to the left and lockpick the next door. This is a simple mini game where we need to move the pick left or right to find the correct spot, then hold it in place three different times. We'll do this throughout the story so you should get used to this kind of mini game anyway. Inside this interrogation room is a key, we're going to grab that and then head back into the hallway again, taking a right turn and entering the next door on our left. In this creepy room we need to interact with the radio and reset the sound wave using the left and right knob until both waves line up and both lights turn green. Then the radio will play a random set of messages. These messages will mention four items in the room. We need to use the black light to find hidden numbers on or near the items mentioned in the message. Again, this is random, so your items and numbers will be different from mine, but once we find our four number code, we can head all the way upstairs to Adler's room and use the code to unlock the safe, grabbing some money and a blueprint for our knife, and most importantly, popping an achievement.
Our second safe can be found during the second half of the mission Blood Feud after the van ride. Unlike the one in the safe house, the rest of the safes are super simple to open. So just follow the path I take around the left side of the building and use the vents to find the room with the safe and the radio. We just need to interact with the radio to match the frequency, then enter whatever code the radio gives us on the safe to open it up. This code is random, so you likely won't have the same as me. Just because I say he likes your food doesn't mean you're bulletproof. Our third safe can be found on Most Wanted. After entering the fundraiser, turn right and sneakily enter the restricted area near the bar. Then continue around the back to find the radio and safe. Again, interact with the radio to correct the frequency, then use the random code to open the safe. And finally, for the hunting season mission, we can find our fourth safe at this enemy encampment. After clearing out the enemies, head into the main building in the center to find a radio that we will need to tune, then use the random code it gives you to open the nearby safe. Our fifth safe can be found on the mission The Cradle. Near the entrance of the compound, enter the left building and head upstairs to find a radio that needs to be tuned, then use the random code it gives you to open the safe embedded into the wall. Our sixth safe can be found on the mission Emergence in the laundry room down the red and blue main hallway. So follow the path I take to find the radio that needs to be tuned and use the random code on the nearby safe. Our seventh safe can be found near the end of High Rollers. After reaching the vault under the casino, head to the elevator to find a radio to tune just to the left. Then use the random code to unlock the safe to the right. Seven, nine, six, zero. 
Our eighth safe can be found in the first area of the airport of the mission ground control. After clearing the room, cross to find the radio that needs to be tuned behind the front desk and use the random code on the safe in the wall of the next room. Our ninth and final safe is found on Under the Radar. Head into the building across from the locked gate that we need to open to progress and go upstairs to find the radio that needs to be tuned next to the stairs. The safe though is behind a gate that we will need to lockpick before we can enter the random code and open it completing the safe cracker challenge and earning a bunch of cash along the way. <laughs> 